Well, what's up guys this is tech and welcome to today's video so i wanted to show you guys something on on your android which this app is probably on your android is definitely probably on your iphone so if you're using ios now i think everyone should have this app um it's called k health to me the reason i'm saying that everyone should have this app is because you can literally diagnose your own problem so if you have something wrong with you you feel like there's a, a certain pain in a certain spot in your body you can go through the whole procedure and it will give you an idea a, if, a, a you know a rough diagnostic to exactly what might be the pain and from there you can you know you know take you out if you need to go see the doctor or if you're gonna take a chance you're like fuck it I don't want to go or you know for other reasons like you might not have health insurance or you're, you don't have um, you know a doctor so you can you know People diagnose themselves all the time. I do it literally all the time. So, um, you know, I think I would have been a great doctor. Dude. <laughs> all right, guys. So this is the app called K Health. Now, I early today did a little funny diagnostic, but we're gonna go through the whole thing called, you know, I said my ass hurts for no reason. I, I was trying to pick a body, and um, I just thought about my butt. Uh, other than other, you know, I wanted to keep it PG you know so that's the best thing i can think of but uh there's so many things you can look at um whatever you can think of you can search it go through the whole diagnostic or now we can do something different if you guys want we can do you know what let's 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 keep it with the ass hurt here all right so butt pain all right butt pain it is all right so apparently here we go okay let me ask you a few questions about your buttocks pain when did it start let's say it started i don't know let's, let's make it a little more advanced like like last month they're gonna, they're gonna be like you're, you're you got cancer or some shit uh thanks for telling me the buttocks pain and foi you need to change the answer just tap the undo arrow which is on this right here okay so which side is it hurt uh which side is it bothering you on i'm gonna say i don't know Okay, did any of these trigger your symptoms? Uh, let's say um, physical activity, you know what I'm saying? Oh, okay, I'm gonna keep it PG. PG, like I said. Uh, all right, uh, do any of these make it worse? Changing positions, lying down, pressing on area, sitting down, standing, walking. Tech, speed it up now. Nobody got no time for this. Walking, yes, okay, walking, next. Has it spread to any of these? Legs, thigh, groin. Oh, yeah, I'll say groin. I'll say that. Okay. Would you describe the pain as burning? Yeah, I don't want to go that excessive. Uh, I want to keep it, like, you know, goth a bit. Say no. All right, do any of these do any of these make it better? Resting, stretching. Let's say uh, stretching. You can always say none of the above. The answer is not what you think it is. Is it getting better, getting worse, or staying the same? We'll say the same. Okay, I have more questions, but before we get to that, can you think of any related symptoms? Uh, I don't know what you're talking about, doctor. Just, I said no. Alright, I'm comparing your case to man age 31 and 37. Oh, thank you for putting my age out there, you piece of sh... Uh, the number of similar cases... Alright, does your back hurt? Hurts right now from fucking listening to you? Yes, let's say it does. Uh, tap, tap the points where your pain, you feel pain. Neck, shoulder... Shoulder blade, upper back, mid back, lower back, flank. What the hell is flank? Side, outer, outer part. I'm gonna say none of the above. Does your back pain radiate to any of these areas? I'm gonna say let's make something here. Flank. What? If, I gotta Google that. Anus. <laughs> oh shit. Yeah, my anus. My anus hurts a lot. A lot. No. We're gonna bleed that. Okay. Do any of these actions make you feel make your back pain worse? Again, changing with the changing positions. What do you think I'm doing? Goodness sake. Physical activity again. I'm like, deep breathing, pressing on the area, sitting down, sneezing, standing, walking. I'm gonna say physical activity. <laughs> okay. Do any of these ease your pain? Applying heat, resting, sitting down, stretching. I'm gonna say resting. She's gonna... Is your pain permanently on the side? On both sides? I don't know. I, 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 thought, we, I thought we went through this already. Does your leg hurt? No. Okay. I'll make it confused as possible. Do you have numbness or tingling in your foot or feet? 
I'm saying no. Uh, do you have pain in your flank? Oh, that's a flank. Yeah, okay. Flank, yes. Do any of these make it worse? For goodness sake. Alright, yeah, physical activity. Okay, does the pain radiate to any of these areas? I swear he, she, I feel like they're asking the same questions. Uh, yes, groin. Buttocks, too. I could've picked more. Does it burn when you urinate? Alright, I'm just gonna say yes. Just fuck, fuck up. How severe is it? I don't know, doctor. I don't know. No. Uh, no, I do not smoke. Unless I smoke hookah. Thank you, Neil. I remember that. Have you been diagnosed with diabetes? Yet? No. Damn, I didn't know watermelon had diabetes. Do you have any of the following symptoms? Hip pain, multiple falls, l limp. I'll say none of the above. Alright, do you have any of the following symptoms? Um, say none of the above. Do you have any of the following symptoms? <laughs> Urine, oh shit. I know where this is going. Uh, scarlet pain. I don't know. Pino, pino pain. I think I'm saying that wrong. I'm, I'm gonna say that. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> uh, do you have sores? Sores or or around your penis? Uh, oh lord. I know where this is exactly going. I'm gonna say no. Okay. Pino discharge. Don't know. Okay, abnormal foma coming out of the tip of the... I'm gonna say... I'm gonna say yes on this one. See what happens. Uh, do you have any of the following symptoms? Unprotected sex. <laughs> You're... Uh, right. Uh, yes. Alright, I do this all the time, of course. Yeah, that's the way to go. Uh, why are you telling me about these symptoms? I want to, I want more information about knowing my condition. I don't know what I have and I want to learn from K. Yes, let's do that. And it says, okay, before I show the results, do you have any other related symptoms? Alright, we're gonna say no. So let's see what happens. Calculating. Alright. Sexual transmitted disease. STD. Holy crap. It looks like I have sexual transmitted disease, STD, an infection with or without symptoms that is transmitted sexual and can lead to a variety of... Holy shit, whatever this is saying. Yeah, 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 HIV. Okay, I've heard of that. Yes, STD. And I'm kidding. No, I always use protection. That's the way to go. Do not. Kids, do not. Yes, what am I saying? Kids. You're gonna have, you know, if you're gonna do what you're gonna do, always go protected. That's the way to go. Okay. Actual, okay, prostate. So, inflammation is a prostate in a small walnut shave gun that is, sits behind the base of the, the penis. It causes the actual... It's usually the same bacteria that can eat, K cause either urinary tract infection or sexual transmitted infection. It can also happen following surgical project. Okay. Wow. So 36% of that is saying. But it's saying more, most likely you have STD. Which is great. So kids, guys, ladies and gentlemen, that's what I have. Apparently I have STD. So, <laughs> so yes, we can always be friends. That's it. Uh, apparently I've been doing some freaky stuff. I have no idea how. Anyways, it's a joke, so don't take it serious. Anyway, so this is... Um, I was just showing you guys a demonstration, so don't take it as, you know, be serious about it when you're doing, you feel like, you know, this is pretty legit. I mean, I feel like it can really help you if you really do have certain issues, you can't understand what's going on, especially as a kid. You don't, you don't ever want to, you know, you, you don't feel like you can tell your, your, your parents or you can't go to the doctor. You know, you can do your own research and then just don't stress about it though. If you feel like, if you find something like, oh, God forbid you have cancer or something, no, it's, it's just not, it gives you something. Uh, but if you're one of those types where you see this, uh, you have sexual transmitted disease and you pass out because of an uh, anxiety attack, then please don't do that. So, anyways, guys, that's that. So, let me know what you guys think. Try it out. And, uh, you know, for yourself. And let me know what results you guys have. And, like, if you guys seriously have issues, like, look it up. Try it out. Let me know what you guys think. No, don't tell me the results. Just, you know, tell me what you guys think about it. So, anyways, uh, that's that. And uh, I'm out, guys. Enjoy. Enjoy.